Hey everybody, this is Charles, Premier Guitar, Nashville, Tennessee, Summer Nam 2014. I'm here with Jimmy. Jimmy's uh, doing the Bigsby Wiggle on his uh, Carbonetti, right? Yeah. Tell me a bit, a bit about this guitar. This looks like a labor of love and a uh, very unique instrument too. Yeah, so this I'm making all from scratch. Uh, no CNC machines, all hand tools, old school. Uh, chiseling all the German carve out, um, winding all my own pickups in the shop with an old sewing machine, um, using a handsaw and basically really old school stuff just to do everything. This one I made for Earthquaker devices for Jamie. Um, so we, you know, collaborate on the pickups and what he wanted in tone and to use for his pickups and everything and just to make it as transparent as possible really and that's my goal. So what did, uh, well first of all, tell me about the pickups because you just mentioned them. Yeah. Um, you got kind of mini humbucker here and then a full a full size humbucker. What did you model these after? So the mini humbucker I wound a bit more on the single coil side. So it has that airiness, really transparent sound. And I did the same on the humbucker, but the humbucker I did about 11K and this is about 12K. So it's fun to push them hot, but then have them you know, a little lower so they're nice and clean. Um, this is one piece of alder and then neck is Madagascar rosewood and maple. So I feel like with those materials, you can get, just have it very true sounding, very, you know, just down the middle and have it be mo more about the player really. And yeah. How do you work from, um, is this a body shape and template that you have devised and used? Cause you got, there's influences all over the place. There's some Italian, there's your German carve over here. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah absolutely. this is a, is this, a design you're going to continue to use? Or? Yeah, I've been doing basses and guitars like this. Um, it's called the Gauntlet model. Kind of uh, was inspired by my favorite guitars. I did the horns from a 335, you know, the offset almost like a jazz master. Um, a bit of Moserite? Yeah, absolutely Moserite. Um, I'm Italian, so I've got, you know, a bit of the that side in me. You know, the headstock, yeah. I always loved bigger headstocks, and I never liked string trees, so I designed the headstock so I moved the headstock back further so it has just a nice, you know, tension on the strings and everything, and yeah, it's been really fun. And also to move the neck joint a bit further down so it feels a bit more compact. But, um... It looks great, yeah, man. Thank you. Yeah, this is the bass I did. This one I did for my friend Albert, who owns Rumpus Room Studios, so I did it more with a studio involved with three pickups um, of course the labella flat wounds you know just to keep it traditional and the best and those are also pickups I wound that are just crazy ones the bottom one was more of like a, a fender single coil the middle is more of like a Gibson single coil than a humbucker in the neck so yeah it's fun just to get different you know varieties of whatever you want, it's all blending. This one's number the first one, the prototype, really. So, you know, a lot of these guitars, you know, that fuse a lot of influences, come together in not so attractive ways. But yeah. you've done some stuff. There's a lot of harmony here. It's really cool. Uh, thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, it's been fun just being a musician first and touring and just kind of coming at building instruments as a touring musician and having yeah. fun. Who'd have thunk? That, that yeah, makes perfect. Right? It's like. Yeah, so I just need to make a clone of myself now. So when I'm on the road, but when you are at home, where do they, where do the people find you? Um, I'm on 74 Orchard between Broom and Grand and the Lower East Side of Manhattan. And That's asking for trouble, man. Oh, very, it's very much trouble. And you, you got a website? Uh, yeah, it's CarbonettiGuitars.com. Mostly on Instagram under Carbonetti Guitars. But uh, you walk into my best friend's menswear shop called by Robert James, and you That's pick up a suit. That's where the Highway 61 yeah, revisited exactly. shirt from, came from. Here. From you know, the the fancy lining. But so it's a clubhouse. We're all very passionate about what we do, and you know we carry only labellas. So it's us, labella, and Mossy, you know, and 
we're on the top floor, we listen to vinyl all day, and it's like a little clubhouse for Lower East Side musicians and anywhere, so it's a fun hang. We're next in Manhattan, go check out the clubhouse. Yeah. Jimmy, thank you very much. Pleasure. It's a pleasure, man. Thanks for having me. And beautiful stuff. Thank you, very thank you so much. much. All right. Signing up from Nashville, Premier Guitar.